relaxed in the Caltex Haveline Stone Brothers transporter because of course David Bernard and Wayne Gardner had their Bathurst campaign come to a sudden halt when through no fault of his own it was a mechanical failure Wayne Gardner ploughed into a wall at Mount Panorama it was an amazing job to get that car back on the track let's see how they did it side by side in the Stone Brothers workshop a testament to how a simple mistake can shatter one dream and how sheer hard work can rebuild another just two weeks ago in Friday practice at Mount Panorama, Wayne Gardner wrote off the Caltex Haveline Ford, what should have been David Bernard's regular championship car for the rest of the series. Too much um, damage in all the roll cage, um, a lot of chassis damage to it. It could be fixed, but it's something that's not going to be done in, um, you know, in a short time. And a short time was all they had. With Indy, New Zealand and Sandown still to go, Bernard needed a car to complete the championship. And what followed was a stunning show of workmanship. A spare chassis transformed almost from the ground up. I've got to say, even I had my doubts, but with these guys from the Caltex Avalon Racing team, mate, they work miracles. They've done it before. They've done it again. The car's ready to go. It's brand new and uh, looking forward to a good race this weekend. The timeline was tight. The crew came back from Bathurst on Monday. They started work on an unpainted body shell on Tuesday, gave it a dummy fit out on Wednesday, assembled on Thursday, and then had the electrics and engine operational by Saturday. A week after Bathurst and a week before Indy, a new car was born. Ross Stone figured he'd work out the cost later. Oh yeah, um, in this business you, you just get on with the, with the job and um, I'll sit down and balance it all later, I guess, but um, it's just a, one of the things, and it is so labour-intensive, um, that's the thing that you have to manage for a start. They managed by sharing staff from the Pertec car across to the Caltex car. Teamwork, putting the pieces in place to put a shattered season back together. I, I drive the car, these blokes work on it. If I do something, they can't be 100% sure that it's right, you know. I just let them do their job. I'll clean it every now and then and help out where I can, but better off just letting these guys do their job. They're, they're a bunch of professionals, they're awesome guys, and they're great friends, you know, and, and I know what I'm supposed to do and they know what they have to do, and together we're a great team, and uh, hopefully this weekend we can get the Ford up there.